Hey guys, it's Dave, and today we're doing another Warframe resource video. Um, but before we get to all that, I have a couple announcements really quick. Um, first of all, this video is brought to you by uh, Brendan, uh, who's, uh, I, just, I hope to God I'm saying that right, who was uh, nice enough to uh, donate some platinum. So, uh, to all you guys that know, that means next week we are going to be having an actual Warframe video on a Warframe. That Warframe will be in, in Naruz. I'll be doing a review of him. And uh, yeah, so just a huge thanks uh, to him. He gave me a ton of stuff, probably probably gave me too much stuff. But uh, this is a huge shout out to him, and I apologize for saying his name wrong because I could not remember if it was Brendan or Bra Brandon. So I'm pretty sure it's Brendan. I'm almost positive, but I'm hoping. Or it's Man with Ass. That's, that's what he wanted to be called, but uh, too, too bad. Um, so, um, yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Now, these are all the ways you can get, uh, obviously from the title, uh, detonate injectors, but uh, they're the best ways I've found. Um, so yeah, let me uh, go ahead and uh, give you my recommendations. First off, the actual, or the, I should say, there's, okay, yeah, there's, there's two ways. Um, the first off, the uh, easy way, I should say, um, there's two easy ways, really, and just a lot of other hard ways. I'll cover the two easy ways. Uh, first off is invasions. This is going to be the primary way I, you know, think most people will probably be getting them. So obviously you go to invasions and you look, and obviously you go to each one, and you see that there's a conflict and what the reward is. So right here we go to this Corpus Siege, and we see that the Grenier are offering the Detonate, Detonite Injector as a reward for helping their faction. Uh, this, you have to um, do it three times to see battle pay qualification, so you have to do this mission three times. Uh, and don't, I don't, I, don't, I don't think it matters, but you pretty much have to just do it three times, and then after the Grenier win, now that's another thing, you might not even get it. You might support them three times and then never get the reward, because they have to win before uh, it gets sent to you. And uh, see, so yeah, it doesn't happen right away. If if they win, then um, you will get a uh, a thing in your inbox, um, sending you. You know, it's, it's, where, where is one? Yeah. See, they'll they'll eventually pay you if they win. That's that's the you know the, the thing, the catch. And then so that's that's the main way. I feel like a lot of people doing it will be getting them unless you have. Um, Unless you're in a clan. If you're in a clan, you can buy blueprints. Uh, I obviously have to go get another one. But you have to buy uh, blueprints. Um, I'll show you. From your clan's chem lab. Do, do, do. So yeah, if anyone wants to be in my clan, go ahead and drop their name down below. Always looking for new members. And... Uh, Run over here. Up the elevator. Obviously, it'll be different if you have your own clan or in another clan. You'll probably know where your own um, chem lab is. But um, yeah, go to your chem lab. Now, if I've already done the research for. Um, the thing. So right here at the very top is detonate injector research. So if you want to, uh, you're going to have to research it first, which takes three days, just like everything in here takes three days. Research it, and then when it's done, you can buy the blueprint. So I'll replicate it, and right here it shows uh, what you need to craft it with. So let's go ahead and buy that for 15000 Now it gives you one blueprint. You have to buy more if you want to head back to your ship. And go to actually just 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 type it in. Uh, there we go. So oh it's a, oh okay. So one bl blueprint left, and uh, you'll notice none of these things look too difficult to get, or they look familiar, except for this uh, dentine dent whatever the hell it's called uh, ample. Uh, those uh, you can get pretty much. They're everywhere. Like they're they're literally everywhere. And uh, 
you don't have to really even farm them. If you've been playing Warframe for any good amount of time, uh, you'll have quite a few of them, because they're just kind of like, um, they're just literally, okay. I was trying to get the list out, okay. Mercury, they spawn on Mercury, uh, Saturn, Uranus, Earth, Sedna, and Ceres. So yeah, literally, they, they drop practically on every planet. Not not everyone, but all of them. And that's gonna be the primary in ingredient in making these. Uh, so yeah, uh, obviously just hit it, and it takes 12 hours to make, and uh, yeah, so that, that's fairly easy. There's obviously a couple ways. That those are the two ways. There, there is the other way that there's uh, certain crates in certain areas that can drop them, but uh, it's it's really quite absurd the drop rate. Like, don't even bother. <laughs> um, that's why I didn't cover them. And uh, so yeah, those are the two main ways you can get it. So yeah, uh, thank you for watching. If you have any ideas for future resource videos, please drop a comment down in the comment section down below. And yeah, next week will be Inunaru's uh, Warframe review. I'm excited for that. Uh, first new Warframe in quite some time. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Next video.